Also at 11 tonight, a family shattered, a loving mother gunned down in her home, her sister watching her die. Now, police need your help finding the killer who targeted Princess Dobbs as she sat with her family. Good evening to you. Thank you for joining us here at 11 tonight. I'm Dave Llewellyn. This car is, this is the car Detroit police say the suspect took off in after riddling the house with bullets. Tonight, 7 Action News reporter Nana Sanchebones, who talked with her heartbroken sister, fed up with the gun violence. Friends and family of Princess Dobbs say she was the life of the party and loved by everyone who knew her. Everybody loved my sister, my sister loved everybody. You can tell 36 year old Princess Dobbs was loved by the number of people who gathered outside this home on Rockdale Street for a candlelight vigil and a balloon release. Her big sister Precious tells us blue was Princess's favorite color. Y'all took my sister away from me. God took my sister away from me. The two were inseparable. Precious and Princess. If you see Princess, you see Precious. Princess and Precious were together on Sunday night. They were sitting at a table in the kitchen. 22, 30, 11, they just start shooting them out. One of the bullets that went through her home hit her sister. Precious tells me Princess died in her arms. Detroit police say Princess was an innocent bystander. That's a lot. Don't nobody deserve to be taken away from their kids. Princess leaves behind three kids, including a two year old. She's two. Detroit police say this is the car they believe the suspect was driving a light colored sedan, possibly a Chevy Cruze. You can see the car driving off just seconds after the shooting. If somebody knows something, like, please, please, because she didn't deserve that. Anyone with information on the shooting is asked to call the police department or Crime Stoppers at 1-800-SPEAK-UP. I'm Nana St. Bonesu for 7 Action News.